Wickedness of a man has no comparison. I saw a video where a politician was saying that voting P2B is voting a seaport in Biafra land. I don't know why man has chosen to be this wicked against his own fellow human being. Because we are all creatures of God. God has given us oxygen for free. God has given us sunlight for free. God has given us rainfall for free. God has given us all the good things of life. Yet, a man, a man, your fellow man, does not want you to enjoy that good, those good things of life. The applaud politician, the air that you breathe, do you know you cannot afford it? You cannot afford God's oxygen. Yes, no matter how rich you are, you can never afford God's oxygen. Hospital can only keep you alive for some time with an artificial oxygen. Once you can no longer afford it, they will switch it off. But this oxygen, you are breathing it free of charge. God gives you sunlight for free. Do you know, without sunlight, without sun energy, we might not have enough food in the planet. Yes, because most of the plants draw their energy from the sun which is called photosynthesis. So to convert it into oxygen and glucose, this is what God gives us for free. We have rainfall that waters the ground so that farmers might have abundant harvest. God gives us all these things for free. And you don't want we especially with the evils, to have a seaport. If God chooses to pay you in your own coin, you see that your seaport in Lagos, God will allow you to overflow and cover the whole of Lagos. And at the end of the day, you will force to come back, come back to Biafra land. Don't take God for a fool. He's the creator to cry it loud. You see all this wickedness, eh? All this wickedness. It's just because God has chosen to show mercy and he's being patient and don't push God to, to, to the wall. Because if people like me cry to God, look, let me tell you, I know my right as a child of God. If people like me cry to God, something must be done. But God is being patient. That your Lagos, you have your seaport there. God might decide, eh? Water will cover the whole of Lagos. And you will, you will be, if you are there, eh? Bragging that you are in Lagos. You will fall, you, God can only keep the Biaf, uh, only that Biafra line. You don't want to build airports. You don't want to build seaports. You will be forced to build it. Yes, I said it. If God chooses to pay you in your own coin, God can choose. You see Lagos. Lagos will be over, overflow with water. This is not, this is, this is, this is a camu case now, compared to what God has done in the past. This, your own case is a camu case, dear. Eh? God can choose to cover the whole of Lagos with water. You see water. No, everything there will be useless. God will keep Biafra land to be a safe place. You'll be forced to come and build that Biafra land. Be warned. I am a servant of God. Be warned. This is a warning to all of you. This is a warning. Don't take God for granted. I didn't want to make this video. But whenever the message comes, I have a lot of things to do. I'm not an idle person. But this message came and I must give it out for reference purpose. Both our own prominent
violent men who are working against us just because of their, 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 their greed. You are working against your own people. You call yourself Igbo man. And you are, you, are, you are working with the enemy against your own people. That is a cause in the highest order. This is, it is a cause. A lot of people are dying. You, you, are you taking God's patience for granted or something? Have you forgotten that this, this God is the creator of the whole universe? There is, there is limit to everything. I don't know. You, 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 you guys are so naive. You are so naive. You, you think you are, you are bragging? Uh, don't don't vent to Peter Obi. This shows how, how, how naive you are. Don't you know that God can choose to cover the whole of Lagos with water? You will be forced to run to Biafra land and come and build that airport you don't want to build. You come and build the, the seaport. Any, God can choose to, to, to make sure that all the places you, you run to, there will be no place for you. You, you must come to Biafra land. That place, that place, oh my goodness, oh man, oh man. That place you don't want to come and build, you must come and build it. You come, you come there and, and buy land by fire by force. You will come to Biafra land and buy land. Yes, I said what I said. And this word I'm saying this morning, does not. it is not my own word. It's hard time you, you people come out from wickedness. You see all the, all the, all the seed you, got, you people are sowing. You are going to reap it one after the other. You will reap all after one after Georgia. Come out from wickedness to cry it loud. Come out from wickedness. You don't take God's patience for granted. Working against one particular people. It put the innocent people. But the, 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 the poor people are there. They are there dying. And you are enjoying. So you know you want to enjoy a, 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 a seaport. You don't want other people to enjoy. People like you that has has the same uh, uh, breath in the nursery like you. You don't want us to enjoy airport. You want us to travel from miles for nine hours to come to Lagos to board before we travel uh, out. You want us to before we clear our, our our goose in the seaport. We will travel miles to convey our goose. To be afraid land before we can get there, all the police, evil people like you people, the police, the army will be on the highway collecting, extracting from us. What have we done? What is our what is our what have we done? What is our sin? What what which which sin did we commit? What, what, which kind of wickedness is this? Look at all the Biafra land. Everywhere has been, everywhere, all the, no road, nothing. <laughs> Do you know what? Eh? You see me, my own word is, you see wickedness. Every one of you must pay. All, all of you will not go unpunished. You must all pay. If you don't pay, your own generation will pay. Unless they repent. I said it. All of you who are who are responsible for the tears, for the tears of our people, you shall all pay. If you don't pay, your generation will pay. Yes. If you don't pay, your own generation will pay. Unless your own generation are against your wickedness. And they will speak against it. Yes. They will speak against the wickedness. You people are, are perpetrating. This is why, 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 what have we done? You're a man that breathes air, you breathe air like God gives you air for free. You are not paying. You don't want us to have airports, you don't want us to have seaports. No, you just want us to, you want, you want our people to suffer from generation to generation. We will not suffer again in Jesus' name. Anybody that wants us to suffer shall suffer in our place in the mighty name of Jesus. I declare this as a servant of God. That anybody that wants us to suffer to suffer in our place, then leave us to go now. You don't want us to that's you want us to remain one Nigeria and still be suffering. What is this? God, in fact, eh? Hey, my God. 
You want us to see the man in one Nigeria and see they suffer? What is all this? Leave us to go now. Let you take your Nigeria, have your airport, have your seaport, and we go and build our own. We are human beings to carry out loud. We deserve good things like you do. Why this wickedness? Must everybody come out from Eastern region and come to Lagos? We still come to Lagos, you won't allow us to be. I bought two plots of land in Ikorodu. I bought two plots, plots of land. The evil men in Ikorodu took over the land. And we are telling us, come today, come tomorrow. Come today, come tomorrow. Is that how you people want us to continue? Must we all leave our, our, own, our own ancestral land and come to North and come to Lagos? You will not still allow us to be. Why not leave us to go? Why not leave us to go to cry it loud? We have tried to 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 to, to cohabit. We have tried to cohabit with your people, but you will not give us peace. We are peaceful people, but you will not give us peace. Why not allow us at least to live good like you? Just to as a human being. Ah, say what, sir? What is all this? Why not leave us alone? Leave Mazin Nam de Kalo. Leave that man. He has he has made a lot of sacrifices. What has he done wrong? What have we done? You see all our, our prominent evil people, eh? Who are working against us on the ground. God will judge you. God will judge you and your generation. Unless your generation, your own offsprings, come out and speak against all this evil. You are working with the enemy. Judas! Mind you, you see, see the way Judas ended up. That's where all of you will end up. Unless you repent. I am a servant of God. You see the way Judas end up, ended up. That's the way you people will end up. Unless you repent. You repent and ask God for forgiveness. Eh? What is all this? Have they, has the enemy taken away your conscience? Where is your conscience? Don't you have feelings for your own, for your fellow human beings? Don't you? You no longer have feelings. Don't you see children are dying because of injustice? We have enough. God, we have enough to get to everybody. But the greedy people can't share. You cannot share. You know why a sea is a dead sea? Because he doesn't give. He collects. He, it collects, it collects, it collects. Then it becomes a dead sea. If you are under the sound of my voice and you don't come out from this evil, mind you, tomorrow does not belong to you. God dealt with great, great nations. God dealt with great nations. Don't you hear the cry of the poor? Don't you hear the cry of the needy? People are we we from eastern region. We have been we have been doing everything to we are just trying to survive. We are only trying to survive. We, we are human beings to cry it loud. People are, are so much pushed to the wall, they don't know what to do again. Why not make things right? Is it a taboo for you guys to make things right? We have enough to cry it loud. Why this wickedness? Look, if you see this video and you don't share, you are among them. You are, make sure that this video gets to each and every one of them. This is wickedness. Why? My good God.